Hi, and welcome to 50 Days of Keynote, 50 Things You Can Create for the Classroom, brought to you by me, Alicia Bankhofer. Day 34 brings you Keynote to Create Jeopardy. What is Jeopardy? It's a popular TV game where players answer trivia questions, and it's really cool because there are different categories and you can choose the points. The higher the points, the more difficult the question. And the answer here acts as prompt, so the contestant or the player answers with a question. For the classroom, it's really ideal because learners can practice their collaborative and communicative skills. When playing in teams, you can really see that teams have to develop a winning strategy, and it's great thus for language learning and team building. Keynote is ideal for Jeopardy because you can easily create questions and answers using text blocks and shapes. You can link the slides to one another. And once you have a great template, you can just easily adapt and readapt to whatever subject you're taught teaching. It's really also good for gamified self-study. So what I would suggest is that you um, use it, for example, for revision of a few topics and you decide which categories you want and create five questions with answers. Then you can prep the table and tally the scores in Keynote as well. So what I did is I, I entered the questions, as you can see here on the grid. It's really easy. And then, of course, the, when you play with the students, you can project it from um, your screen or from the interactive whiteboard. Um, playing in Teams is really cool. And you, as I said, you can use a file to tally the score. Teams would either call out their answers or write them down, and the team with the most points wins. So I'll show you how to link the elements. Now I'm going to show you how to link from one slide to another. It's really easy. So let's say I want to do jobs for 10 points. I double tap on the 10. It's going to give me the option link. Then I'm going to say, OK, I want to link to slide number three because it's right there. And then just to test it, let's just see if it works. I go into presentation mode and I tap on the 10 with jobs and it really works. Very good. And let's see how the work it works back to the main Jeopardy screen. I double tap here because I've done it on the master slide. As you can see on the master slide, it links to slide one. The left arrow links to slide one and the right arrow links to the next slide. So then it's really easy to navigate within the presentation as you go along. And there you have it. You could easily play Jeopardy in the classroom using questions that you yourself define and the students will have a lot of fun doing it. There you have it. 50 days of Keynote. All videos are on Padlet and all Keynote files are here. See you tomorrow.